Apple's AirPods have dominated the truly wireless headphone category since their arrival in late 2016, but now they have some real competition. Jarba's new Elite 65T and water-resistant Elite Active 65T not only have a more refined, comfortable design than Jabra's earlier Elite Sport models, but they offer improved performance, excellent call quality, and voice support for all major virtual assistants, including Amazon's Alexa on the go. I thought they had slightly richer and more immediate sound than the AirPods with more robust bass, and they aren't incredibly expensive at $170 and $190 respectively. These new models leave out the heart rate monitor found in the Elite Sport, but that's a good thing. It allowed Jobber to shrink the design and these headphones fit much better and don't require any wings or fins to keep them securely in your ears. Battery life is rated at five hours, the same as the AirPods, and the included compact charging case gives you an extra two charges. I use the standard Elite 65 at the gym and it survived just fine, for lighter workouts anyway, but the Elite Active 65T is considered the real sports model. It's got a grippier finish thanks to a special coating and is water resistant and is equipped with an integrated accelerometer for tracking stuff like rep counts. These are noise isolating earphones which means they passively seal out ambient noise while the AirPods open design lets a lot of ambient noise in. But there's a hear through transparency feature that you can toggle on in Jabra Sound Plus companion app that allows sound to leak in. That's a good safety feature for runners and bikers who need to hear traffic around them. The app also has an equalizer that allows you to tweak the sound for music listening, as well as treble and bass boost modes for call audio. Additionally, you can opt to have your music pause automatically when you pull a bud out of your ear and have your music resume once you put the bud back in. To skip tracks forward and back, you hold down the up or down volume buttons on the left earpiece. You do have a choice of voice assistants. On iOS devices, you can toggle between Siri and Alexa, and on Android devices, you can go with Google Now or Alexa or the default voice assistant. Just like with other wireless headphones, you have to press a button and hold it to access the voice assistant. Overall, I didn't find much to complain about. It'd be nice if there was just one Elite 65T and that model was fully water resistant, but otherwise these are a big step forward from the earlier Elite Sport earphones. They're superior to the AirPods in some way, so definitely check them out if you're in the market for a set of truly wireless headphones. I'm David.